Welcome and welcome back to the channel. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on notification bells, and give this video a thumbs up if you are excited to explore the real facts about internet performance in Africa. In this video, we are diving into a hotly debated topic which African country has the best internet among Kenya, Nigeria, South Africa, and Rwanda. This video is fully packed with facts, stats, real user experiences, and government policies that are shaping the internet landscape across the continent so stick with us till the end i might just be surprised by what we uncover so when people think about the internet in africa they often paint the entire continent with one brush but the truth is that internet quality varies greatly from country to country in this video we'll focus on four african nations that are making major moves in the digital space kenya nigeria south africa and rwanda have all stood out in recent years for their efforts in broadband penetration mobile internet growth and investment in ICT infrastructure, but which one truly leads the pack? So let's start with Kenya, often dubbed as the Silicon Savannah. Kenya has carved a name for itself in the digital world. Nairobi is home to a thriving tech ecosystem and is the birthplace of M-Pesa, one of the most successful mobile money platforms globally. Kenya boasts impressive 4G coverage, especially in urban areas, and was among the first in Africa to test and roll out 5G networks. According to Speed Test Global Index, Kenya's average download speed often was around 30 to 40 Mbps. This is significantly higher than many of its regional pairs. Fiber optics are expanding rapidly thanks to initiatives from Safari, Com, Zuku, and Fiber. But how does Nigeria compare as Africa's most populous nation and one of its largest economies? Nigeria has a massive internet user base. Over 154 million people in Nigeria use the internet, making it the largest online population in Africa. Despite this, Nigeria struggles with consistent internet quality. While major cities like Lagos and Abuja enjoy decent connectivity, rural areas often lag far behind. Nigeria's average internet speed is typically lower than Kenya's, ranging from 15 to 25 Mbps on good days. The Nigerian Communications Commission has invested heavily in broadband penetration plans, but challenges such as infrastructure deficits and power supply issues still hamper progress. Now, let's take a look at South Africa, often considered the tech hub of the continent. South Africa leads in many digital indices and is known for its advanced telecommunications sector. MTA and Vodacom, two telecom giants based in South Africa, offer high-speed internet to millions of users. South Africa was also among the early adopters of 5G in Africa and has extensive fiber optic coverage in major cities like Cape Town, Johannesburg, and Durban. South Africa consistently ranks high in internet speed test, often averaging between 40 to 50 Mbps in urban centers. However, the digital divide between urban and rural areas remains a concern. Let's not underestimate Rwanda, although it's the smallest of the four countries we are comparing. Rwanda is often cited as a model for digital transformation in Africa. The Rwanda government has invested heavily in ICT through its Vision 2020 program and Smart Rwanda Master Plan. Kigali, the capital, is one of the most connected cities on the continent with widespread fiber and Wi-Fi availability. Rwanda has also implemented a national broadband strategy that connects rural areas through 4G light, making internet more accessible than in many larger nations. Though the average download speed is lower, around 10 to 20 Mbps, the consistency and affordability of assets are noteworthy. Before we continue, here is a quick call to action. Let us know in the comment section where you are watching from and what your experience with internet in your country has been. Is your internet fast, reliable, affordable? We want to hear from you. Now, let's talk affordability. Having fast internet is great, but can people afford it? In Kenya, mobile data is relatively affordable. Nigeria, on the other hand, offers some of the cheapest data in the world. South Africa's internet, while fast, is more expensive. We want to sit somewhere in the middle. So in terms of cost, Nigeria wins, but the quality trade-off is notable. When it comes to reliability, South Africa and Kenya often lead the way. Kenya's Safaricom network is known for stable connections, 
while South Africa's fiber networks maintain high uptime. In contrast, frequent power outages in Nigeria significantly affect internet reliability, even if mobile networks are strong. Rwanda, thanks to its centralized planning and smaller size, often delivers a more consistent experience, especially in Kigali. What about government policies and infrastructure investment? Rwanda shines brightly in this category. The government has partnered with Korea Telecom to build a 4G LTE network that covers over 95% of the population. Kenya has made strides, I mean, huge strides through public private partnerships and favorable regulatory environments. Nigeria, while ambitious in its broadband plans, still faces bureaucratic and logistical challenges. South Africa has a mature telecom sector, but policy inconsistencies sometimes delay progress. Now, let's shift focus to mobile penetration and smartphone usage. Kenya and Nigeria lead in mobile money and app usage with smartphone penetration at around 60 to 70 percent. South Africa's smartphone market is more mature with higher end devices being more common. Rwanda again is growing rapidly, especially among younger users in urban areas. And we can't forget about local content and digital innovation. Kenya leads with platforms like Mpesa, Ushahidi, and a wave of local startups. Nigeria is close behind with a booming fintech scene and a green e commerce sector. South Africa excels in digital media and online services, while Rwanda is investing in coding schools and tech incubators. So, which country has the best internet overall? The answer isn't as straightforward as it seems. Each country has its strengths and weaknesses. If you are looking for speed, South Africa might be your best bet. For affordability and digital inclusiveness, Kenya and Rwanda stand out. For reach and market size, Nigeria dominates. Still watching, hit that like button if you are enjoying this deep dive. Your support helps us create more content like this. Now, let's touch on user satisfaction. Surveys from Okla and other analytics firms often show that users in South Africa and Kenya report higher satisfaction with their internet experiences. Nigerian users often cite frustration with speed and downtime. Rwanda users, though fewer in number, often express satisfaction due to its reliability and affordability of access. Looking into the future, Kenya and Rwanda are focused on smart city development and increasing rural access. Nigeria's massive market gives it great potential if infrastructural issues are addressed. South Africa continues to lead in innovation but must address the rural urban divide. What about internet for businesses and remote work? South Africa has the AGA with its fast and stable connections. Kenya follows with increasing fiber to the home installations. Rwanda's tech ecosystem is attracting startups. Nigeria, while reaching talent, still faces barriers like inconsistent power supply. For those in the education sector, Rwanda's One Laptop Per Child initiative and widespread school connectivity stand out. Kenya also ranks high with digital learning programs. Nigeria and South Africa are investing, but rural outreach remains a gap. If you are just joining, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss our next comparison. We are planning more deep dives into African tech development, city infrastructure, and lifestyle. When it comes to public Wi Fi and access hubs, Rwanda and Kenya are making bold moves. Kigali's city-wide Wi-Fi and Kenya's digital hubs in rural areas give users free or subsidized access. Nigeria and South Africa offer all sports, mostly in urban centers. Tech talent and developer communities are also crucial. Nigeria has one of the largest developer communities in Africa, despite internet challenges. Kenya and South Africa are right behind with growing numbers of coding boot camps and tech events. Rwanda is emerging with initiatives like Andela and Kamijen Melo University's Africa campus. Finally, let's compare cybersecurity and data protection laws. South Africa has a comprehensive law. Kenya passed its Data Protection Act in 2019, and Rwanda has adopted strict privacy frameworks. Nigeria's frameworks are evolving, but implementation has been consistent. So, who takes the crown? It really depends on your priorities. Speed, South Africa. Innovation and assets Kenya, strategic planning Rwanda, market size Nigeria. Ultimately, the best internet experience will depend on where you are, what you can afford, and what you value most in a digital experience. So thanks for sticking with us to the end. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to stay updated on all things Africa, tech, and lifestyle. Which country do you think has the best internet? Drop your opinion below. We are reading every comment. Until next time, stay connected.